This episode is brought to you by our friends at Hover, the easiest way to buy domain names and do more with them. Get 25% off today by visiting hover.com slash misdownload. Hey, welcome to Miss Download. I'm Cheryl Porte. Now, one of the things that I'm working on this year is saving for a house, and I'm really excited, and I have a great friend who's helping me. Now, the first thing that my friend had me do was put together a budget and an expense form to keep track of my money, where it is, what I spend it on, all that kind of fun stuff. So, of course, I went looking for a program that could help me, and I found it. It's called Bank Tree Personal Finance, and it's a program out of the UK that really is a wonder. First, it is the absolute easiest finance program that I have ever seen. It is so easy that your kids can actually use it, and I actually recommend that you get them to, because, you know, learning how to budget your money is a lesson that everyone needs to learn. So we're going to open it up right here, and as you can see, it's really very easily laid out. You can add accounts, payees, investments, scheduling, reports. It allows you to do everything that a great financial program should do. It also allows for more than one user, yay, which is really convenient. Now, when I first saw that it was from the UK, I wondered how it would work with other currencies, but then I found that it has 164 different world currencies listed in the program, so I knew that it wouldn't be a problem. Now, I'll show you how easy it is. Let's just add an account here. Uh, we're going to call this a savings account, and we're going to give it a fancy number, bank, a group of accounts, the bank account, and let's just put in sample bank for right now. Um, what's really cool is that you can add whatever institution that you want to, and what you can do is put a link in for that financial institution. So if you're in the program and you realize, oh my goodness, I have to pay a bill right now, you can just click on the link, it allows you to pay the bill, and then you can fix it right in your program right away. Let's say our opening balance here is $1,000, and the currency is going to be in Australian dollars, because I've always wanted to go to Australia. And you save that, and now you've got another account. Uh, so let's take a look at some of the other things. Categories like this is this is really what I was looking for so this is like for me this is where I get my money's worth it lets you set up a budget now that's what I need and what you do is you add what you've spent in each category what you're allowed to spend and then it tells you how much you have left to spend you can also add categories for instance oh look I added the category earlier there is a shoe category but you know what else I want to add I want to add uh, dress dresses so let's do the payment type. That's going to be an expense, and we're going to save that. So now I have a budget for shoes and dresses. It's very important. Now under reports, it actually uh, allows you to print off a bunch of different reports. It allows you to keep either a virtual or a paper trail of everything that is within the program. Now you can find Bank Tree Personal Finance at twocows.com. There's a 14-day free trial, but you can buy it for about $40. Now trust that this is a great program. If you're looking for other great programs, go to butterscotch.com. Check out me, Miss Download, and my Butterscotch friends. This episode is brought to you by our friends at Hover, the easiest way to buy domain names and do more with them. Get 25% off today by visiting hover.com slash misdownload.